case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1996, the United States Court of Appeals for the Fourth Circuit heard the case of Juisti v. Hyatt Hotel Corp., which centered on whether a hotel can be held responsible for harm to its guests that could have been reasonably foreseen, even if the specific harm was not anticipated. This lawsuit stemmed from an incident at the Hyatt Regency Hotel in Baltimore, Maryland, where a cleaning crew accidentally set off a fire alarm, forcing the Juisti couple and other guests to evacuate. During the evacuation, Mrs. Juisti experienced shortness of breath and later developed a collapsed lung. The couple sued the hotel for negligence, but the lower court granted summary judgment in favor of the hotel, ruling that the injury was not a reasonably foreseeable result of the hotel's negligence. The case was appealed and reviewed de novo by the United States Court of Appeals for the Fourth Circuit, which vacated the district court's judgment and remanded the case for further proceedings. The appeals court maintained that the issue of foreseeability should be decided by a jury, and the district court's analysis was incorrect. As the case was remanded for further proceedings, both the question of whether the hotel's negligence caused the alarm to go off and the proximate cause of the injury remained unresolved. The jury trial would ultimately determine the hotel's liability in this case. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.